Yes, my name is Coach J. If you've this is your first time being on any of my lives, I own Ellison Consulting. I am a business coach. I've been a business coach for many years. Um, old career was in therapy, in social services, then I converted over to HR, um, talent and acquisition, and then moved into the coaching round, which I have been doing that full time for three years now. Praise the Lord. I have been blessed to build a multi six figure coaching practice. There was no sugar daddy in the picture. None of those things apply. Just hard work, very intentional, keeping myself recharged and diligently making it an effort, making it priority to grow every single day. Hey, Kimberly. Hey, 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 Shonda. How many people have responded back to you? Everything has a story. What is your close, uh, your closing rate? When we build businesses, we only think that it's for now. We don't have big picture visions. We don't have big visions. We don't think that we're going to grow a team at some point. We don't think we're going to have a payroll. I assure you 110% that if you're just doing a little bit here and a little bit there, you're not going to get there. I don't care how saved you are. I don't care how much you love the Lord and he heard your cry and pity ever grown. It ain't happening. You show your faith by how you treat your time and how you treat your business. Beyonce, everybody, what you think about Beyonce? I'm, I'm focused on my path. Beyonce is rich. We're going on. I downloaded the album. I love the album. I listen to it every now and then, but I'm, I don't have any, like, I don't have the time and the, and the energy to do a complete synopsis and roadmap about Beyonce's album and what it means to me. Well, I ain't see you say nothing about Beyonce I, because I don't have anything to say. What, what do I say? Well, you know, they say her album is, I, I didn't even notice. I mean, we have a complete breakdown, bar graphs, point at what the horse means, what this song represents, what artistry is, but your business is in poverty state. Make it make sense to me. <laughs> Generating at least 50, 75,000 in your company, coach. I need you to get out of the Beyonce conversation and come back into your now because you got to build a business, okay? You ain't got, you don't have that kind of time. Mm -mm. I'm just trying to help you. I'm, I'm really trying to just help you see that it's okay to think differently than the masses. It's okay to think that this is what divides the 1% from everybody else. The 1% is not, they, they probably don't even know Beyonce came out with anything because they're not paying attention. Nobody's, a lot of people ain't paying attention. And I ain't talking about the 1% in the entertainment industry. I'm talking about the 1% that's actually in the trenches doing the work. Well, I got to get my rest. Baby, these people are already up four o'clock, five o'clock. They up working. How did you do this, Mother? Well, I didn't, you know, I didn't get any sales. It's because your time, you treat time like trash. Even if you got to schedule your naps, schedule your me time, schedule your, your, your self-care and your nighttime routine. Every hour has an assignment. So when people are calling with that mess, talking about, girl, let me tell you about what happened at, at so-and-so uh, club. The other night. I don't have an opinion. I don't have the bandwidth. I don't... I'm going to talk to you in September because August, I got to flip this baby. August is it. Mm -mm. We got to go on. This ain't play season. This ain't just be in the energy and look around and see everybody else win it except for me season. This is not that type of season we need. We want to build wealth, but we're not willing to do what it takes. That's why I said some of y'all need to stop talking about you're going to be a wealth and just say, look, I need to get into a space where I can produce. We're not following up. We're not doing our due diligence. We're not focused on the path. Are you creating your frameworks? Are you following up with your clients? Are you creating offers that, that, that brings clarity? Are you working on your messaging? Are you creating impeccable content that gets people to turn their heads towards you? Are you tracking your metrics? 
What does your bookkeeping look like? If you don't like doing your bookkeeping, get to a space in your business where you can hire someone to help manage your funds. Until you can start, because let's be 100. That is, no ma'am, you got to pay taxes. Hello. I'm getting all up in y'all business. Because see, July and June and May, you, you play all that time. Self-care, I'm going to sit in this. I got to get an alignment. I got to meditate. I got to journal. I got to go see what the Lord says about this. I got to go fast. I got to go do all this. And it has not yielded a return because you're still in the same spot that you were supposed to be doing all this inner work on. You do. That's why it, it, it proves my whole point. You do the inner work and you heal as you go.